to the right, I mean, we got my man T Black right here. You guys probably see him all over Instagram with his shenanigans, doing what he does best. I think I did it again. It's right here. I found it. <laughs> Well, you look as good as me, it ain't hard. <laughs> Yo, what up? Welcome back to the video, guys. We are here at the Tour Custom Cycle Shop, and right to the right, I mean, we got my man T Black right here. You guys probably see him all over. Instagram with his shenanigans, doing what he does best. Kind of like white chicks, but on a bike. Of course, <laughs> just living life, man. That's the enemy. I like that. I like coming for Terry Crews. He can't do it as good as me. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> I like that. Terry Crews took about 10 shots to get it right. It only took one. <laughs> <laughs> so we're actually here. He's getting his 1K mile here at the Tour Custom Shop. We got Mike in the back. Yo, but where's the ballhorn at? It's right here. I found it. <laughs> <laughs> that works better. So while he is going to be getting his 1K mile done, I'm going to ask you a few questions. How the hell did you end up all over the, all the, all the feeds everywhere? And how did you start off? How did it happen? <laughs> when, when you look as good as me, it ain't hard. <laughs> <laughs> um, a regular day, man. I was just cruising the town, left the crib. You know, as we say, I ain't gonna say I left my house. I left the crib and um, making a move through the city in my zone, playing what I wanted to play. I moved the crowd. Right, so that's what that's what I do. I moved the crowd. Let me ask a question now. Is this is this? Is that what you're listening to all the time? Is pop music every day? Like? Every day. Every day. Every day. That's your thing. Every day. That's your shits. Every day. <laughs> I, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna say. No, I fuck with it. That's I fuck all with it. that I listen to. I, I, I like. I like rap music. I like R&B, but that's not my go-to. You know. So your go-to is pop music. Yes. If that's how I'm feeling, that's what it's gonna be. If I today is Sunday, on my way here, I had a little gospel going. I like you that. know. I got. If you see my playlist. I can't share with y'all because a lot of people have been asking about my playlist. I can't share that with y'all. <laughs> I was just gonna ask go, like, no, I ain't gonna like, have a playlist. No, I can't share a playlist. I do have a playlist though, but a lot of times I just let it run. And then the majority of the songs that comes on, I know because this is what I do. I, I, I'm, I'm one of the guys that listen to 103. Yeah. You know, so. I mean, I know, it's, it's normal. Listen, I, I, I was out with my wife the other day and it was on Backstreet Boys and NSYNC with me in the car. <laughs> I swear to God. And the crazy thing is, when it, when it happened, it just. It was there, like I was riding, stopped at a light, I'm vibing, people start recording. I didn't even realize I was being recorded. And when I realized I was being recorded is when I was in the barbershop shaving my head. Mm. Cause I got a, a call from a close friend of mine. He's like, yo bro, you all over the internet? And I'm like, damn, I know I don't do nothing illegal, but maybe somebody that looked like me. So I panicked, went to the barbershop, shaved my hair, I had locks, shaved my hair off. And as I'm in the chair, he called back again, like, why you don't want to talk? I'm like, yeah, what's up? What's going on? He's like, yo, bro, you all over the internet, they love you. He sends me the link, and that was the first time I seen him. Really? And I was like, yo, this is amazing. I just continue to do me, but I ain't gonna lie. After that one video, when I seen that they liked the vibe and the things that I was doing, I took advantage of it. I went and got more speakers so the bike could be a lot more louder. I started dressing a little bit more nice, you know, because I, <laughs> I would just I would just get on a bike with, with, with nothing on. I'm like, man, I'm going outside, but. Now I realize I was being watched, so you know, you're a public figure now, so. Yeah, man. At this point, a lot of people think that um, it's all for the camera, it's all for the crowd. This is what makes me feel good as a person. If I feel like I wanna listen to DMX when I come outside, that's what you guys are gonna hear. And you got people out here that complain about my music being loud. They complain about a lot of things. I, I, I love the negative criticism just as well as the positive criticism. I, pre I prefer, personally, the negative criticism because mm. it critiques me and, and, and show me that you're paying attention to what I'm not. I like that. So it, it makes me a better person, even though I'm not here to please anyone, because at the end of the day, I gotta be happy with myself, but it shows that you're not only here 
to listen to my music or you're not only here because I'm giving a vibe, but it shows that you're actually paying attention. Yeah, yeah. So you're hating, but you're paying attention. So that's a good thing. You're gonna like me because I, I like to go out in the comments and I like to just go for the, all the negative comments first. I'm like, okay, let's read this one, this one. I like that. See, but even with that, like I get a, I get a lot of negative comments. I, I actually had one comment where a guy told me he wished he sold me, so he'll run up to me and punch me in the face. <laughs> and I see the comment and I'm like, Okay. That's cute. I'm like, that's cute. I said, if only if he knew, but I'm like, <laughs> I'm not gonna entertain it. And then about two hours later, everyone else jumped on his ass. Yeah. So I sat back and I said, oh, this is, this is, this is fun. I don't got to defend myself no more. Uh, no, but for the most part, it's a beautiful thing, man. I'm born and raised in Brooklyn, been living in Jersey six years now. Dirty Jersey. I don't regret it. Um, I don't, I don't regret how uh, 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 investing in this Harley here. Um, this bike right here changed my life for the good. It um, showed me that there's a lot more to life than just hanging outside and want to do nonsense. It just showed me that there are positive people in the world and there are people that's looking and you meet a lot of great people. I met a lot of great guys just coming over to talk custom cycles. And they treat me well. So they treat sweet. me well. <laughs> and, and look, this is crazy because this is actually the first time that I'm meeting this yeah, guy. Facts. He's amazing. Facts. A lot of people like, subscribe, get next to him. Marvel Kid on YouTube, Instagram. Follow me on YouTube, RH Customs. Lock in to talk customs cycles on Instagram. Get next to us. We working. Yeah. I'm getting my 100, my 100K mile service done. So my baby right now is in urgent care, but she's not out of commission. We'll see you soon. Get this camera out of my face. get checked, axles get torqued, uh, brake calipers get torqued, you know, just all the various important fasteners. Very good. Yeah. This is all coming from the heart attack. Stop recording. <laughs> <laughs>